so you want to learn front-end development but don't know which courses or resources to follow in order to do so. So don't worry, in this video you are going to find the best resources to learn front-end technologies. I have also tried all these free and paid resources to learn this technology. That's why I am going to share these resources with you, right? But towards the end of this video, I will share a bonus tip about how you can finish this course successfully. So please keep watching this video until the end. So hello everybody, I am Ajay Yadu. Again, welcome back to my channel. So let's doubt ko out karte hain. Before getting into the video, I would like to share only one thing. Everything is free, but you have to put in your 100% effort to learn anything that you want to be. So you can't make any excuses like I am not able to purchase that course. No, it's not true. All you need to have the dedication to learn something. So let's move on to the first resources I would like to recommend you, which is Free Code Camp. In fact, I have received a certificate from this platform. Yes, you can also earn a certificate from Free Code Camp after completing the courses. In the course curriculum, you will learn all concepts by building a small projects, and at the end of the course. You will need to build five projects and submit their code on Free Code Camp. Then you will able to grab the certificate. Free Code Camp offers multiple courses like HTML, CSS, front-end libraries, back-end, etc., and many more courses are available on this platform. You can also explore it yourself. Now my next favorite course is Meta Front-end Development Course on Coursera. This is also a great course that is a combination of nine courses. Here you will learn HTML, CSS, JavaScript, Git and GitHub, React, and fundamentals of UI UX as well as interview preparation. These are separate courses that are parts of the Meta Frontend Development course, so you don't miss out on this fantastic opportunity. Also, this is not a completely free course, but you can access most of the resources for free after enrolling in it. However, if you want to get this course for free, leave a comment in the comment box, and I will make a video about it. Now, if you are able to pay approx five dollar, then you should purchase a responsive web development course by Jonas on Udemy. He has also created a CSS advanced course that thoroughly teaches the language. But you have to finish his responsive web development course first, and then you will able to understand the advanced CSS course. They are great courses and have good rating points as well, so you can also consider these courses. And for JavaScript, Jonas has created the best courses on JavaScript that is most popular on Udemy or in developer communities as well. So you should definitely check these out courses on Udemy. Now the time comes for the first bonus tip of this video that is take a challenge on social media. Yes, take a challenge because consistency is the most important tip that we should keep in mind. You can also say that consistency is the medicine for tuberculosis TB. Once you break it, then you have to start from scratch. So you should announce in public on any social media that I am going to start my 100 days of code or my 30 days of code or etc. using a specific hashtag and try to complete those commitments. I have also completed some challenges on CSS and JavaScript on Twitter. You can also follow that along with your journey. The link is given in the description box, so do not forget to check it out. After completing your commitments, do not forget to reward yourself. Here are some of my rewards. The second bonus tip in this video is that you do not need to create content in your early days. I have already uploaded a video on that, so you just need to watch that video as well. And the final tip is that read a topic from different sources. Simply have to search for a topic on Google and then read that topic from well-known websites like MDN, JavaScript.info, JavaScriptTutorial.net, W3School, G4G, etc. By the way, I will make a video on it in which I will share how to learn something with the bare minimum of resources. On that note, I hope this video will be helpful to you. So let me know in the comment box and hit the like button. Also, do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching this video.